So I'm going to present you a open data for rural development. So it's quite interesting. Uh, uh, over presentation. Yeah. So, and we expect that uh, this rural experience can be replicated uh, in urban area. Yeah. Because usually it's reverse. That's right. Okay. And it's a definition of urban. What is a city? <laughs> what is a community? So, go over yes. to you, Malik. Okay, thank you. So, you know, thanks to decentralization, so municipalities are responsible. I have some responsibility that where uh, the central government were res uh, responsible for before. So, and now the point is uh, to, to check to see whether they are fulfilling uh, the, their responsibilities. And we, cho we have chosen to, to monitor uh, some indicators and to, uh, to assess and to see whether the municipalities are, uh, perform are performing very well or not. So, and this for, to, to, to see if transparency can improve the performance of uh, municipalities in Burkina Faso. Okay, so here is the map of uh, Burkina. So it's in West Africa. And we have uh, uh, up to 351 local government, and mostly most of these uh, municipalities are in rural area. So, Superboom is the contracted form of civil uh, la performance uh, uh, municipal, and it's a, a annual municipal performance survey. And uh, we, we are monitoring now a, a several indicators and on of public service delivery and institutional capacity for the country's uh, 349 municipal government. And we, we have started with uh, some pilot municipalities and the objective is to extend this initiative to all the municipalities of the team. So there is an organization, so it's uh, of course uh, funded by World Bank and a bit by the government of Burkina. But we have uh, a, a technical team that is working on a uh, super moon. And uh, we also have a research team that is working uh, on the data, uh, collective data, to make some research and maybe to share, to do some suggestion to uh, the government. So I'm going to talk about some of these uh, indicators. So the first one and important for us is uh, a, about Latvia. So we want to see whether the municipality are able to 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 to, to build a Latvian for each school. Well, it's very important. Like uh, if you can imagine, like Vizuna uh, del Arte without a, a toilet. So mm. it's uh, it's the same for school. So we need to make sure that each school have a, a toilet. We also we are also monitoring uh, indicators on uh, water access because it's also very important and. The objective is to make sure that uh, someone will not walk uh, uh, over one kilometer in order to, to have water. We are also monitoring indicators on health, so especially on children between uh, 0 and 11 more, to make sure that they have uh, the necessary, they have done the necessary vaccination. So it's the main indicators that we are uh, monitoring. And when we collect all the data, so we make some poster and display all the poster in, in the city so that citizens can see the performance of their municipality and they can 
ask question to the, the mayor or to the local, uh, I mean the, this local civil uh, society to check for the, the, uh, to the local government to see how they can improve this and this and also if they have some suggestion so they can go and talk with the local government. So uh, yes, we also publish the data on the national open data platform so you can access to all the, the collective data on data.gov.bf and we also use the data to make some application like uh, Carto, this application map the existing uh, water point and latrine in Burkina Faso. So it's just a, a use case of, uh, I, I mean the reusing of data that are collected at a uh, rural uh, level. So as I have said, this process can be replicated in urban area. So, but we are, I mean, uh, we are not at the beginning, but we are still testing the system. And when we will make sure that it works, so we will uh, try to replicate in rural area. Thank you. Thank you.